Classic cars, vintage clothes and the smell of motor oil in the air, well it can only be the Goodwood Revival. Now in its 19th year the event has become one of the world's most celebrated historic motor racing events, with race fans coming from all over the country to soak up the unique atmosphere. I mean it's lush isn't it, you know, anyone that's, uh, that loves cars and bikes and you know, motor racing, there really isn't anything like this in the world and it's... Yeah, we're lucky to be here, you know, to be invited to come and compete at this is, is ace. And, you know, we affectionately could, uh, refer to Charles Lord March as LM, and he does a brilliant job, you know, LM, this is amazing. Now I'm racing here, we, we had a first part of the St Mary's yesterday. Uh, I got a second, so I got to smoke a cigar and kiss a pretty girl. And then uh, I'm, I'm in the TT this afternoon in a Corvette Stingray. Do you know what? I, every time I come, I want to drive a different car. So, of course, we all want to win, but it's not about that. It's just about having some fun. One of the most hotly contested races is the Austin J40 pedal car race, with junior racers competing for the Setrington Cup. You came first place? Yes. How much fun was the race? Uh, good. Really good fun. What was the best bit about the race? Um... Winning. Winning. <laughs> I've won every single race since I've been here. Really? Yeah, I seriously have. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not just the revival is a celebration of motor heritage, but for the first time it was also the stage for a British supercar company to launch its latest model. We bought the company in 2014, started to work out what it needed to be, size, shape, dimensions and all that sort of stuff. Um, and then we did our first uh, clay model. We spent a long time with that and then uh, threw it away. It just wasn't going to be a TVR. It's a difficult thing, you know, to define what is a TVR, what's the DNA. Sure, they're fast, noisy, powerful, British, but, but how do you embody that in a car? When you look around at all the TVRs here, there's a lot of different uh, stuff going on in them and not necessarily uh, physical traits that follow the whole way through the DNA. So, we started from scratch. I had very high expectations because I know what I've done is great. What we as a team have done is amazing. Gordon Murray, Cosworth, all the guys at TVI, it's outstanding. When the curtain was down on the first day of reveal. You never know what other people are going to think about it, though. You may, I mean, I know it's fantastic, but they may not think that. So, uh, but now I know. It has been overwhelmingly positive. There's never been a new car launched at the Goodwood Revival. This is the first time. It's the 70th anniversary of uh, TVR, and we felt that uh, Revival, you know, the revival of the car, the Goodwood Revival was a great opportunity to sort of do that. In the heartland, you know, in terms of it's a British, British, British bred, British built, British owned sports car, and it's, it's revival, iconic. So this was the perfect spot for it. As ever, it's not all about the racing, with a host of performers scattered amongst the stands. Lost the van and don't know where to ride. How old are you, Freddie? 11. 11 months old, you look about 45. How old are you really? 11. Oh, oh, I see, 11. I was 12 when I was your age. Put a smiley face right there. <laughs> Good, yeah, give it a nose and some ears and a head and stuff. You've got to put some effort in now, you're not at school. <laughs> oh, yeah, now he's good. Yeah. <laughs> Come to good with that, love you. I'll get it. Despite the rain, the racing continued, even if not everyone managed to stay on the track. This is Richard Stringer for That's TV.